Bodhi. Today is Monday, October 15, 2018. I've been wondering, this market in go, well, P's gapped higher, sold off fairly hard, but then came back to close eh, pretty much right around where they started. They did get back above their 200-day moving average. Nothing magical about that or any moving average for that matter, but something like daylight meaning lows are greater than moving average can help to keep you on the right side of the market. See my website for more on that. I actually would have preferred if this thing would have gapped way lower, scared the bejesus out of everybody, and then had a nice opening gap reversal you know the routine though one day at a time that that would have shaken out the nervous at least he tried to say as you can see nasdaq gapping higher ended up right about where it started right at that 200 day moving average as you can see all these indices have bow tie down speaking of bow ties down the russell 2000 triggered a bow tie way back here on the daily sold off fairly hard so far from that little bit of a gap opening on monday and closing down towards flatsville in here. So what do we do? Well, on your stops on any leftover longs, be super duper selective on new ones and start considering a short or two. Any questions, as usual, Dave at DaveLander.com. I'm Dave Landry and you just heard about it.